In this episode of Quick Sites, we are discussing hybrid app development. My name is Andre, and our guest in this episode of Quick Sites is Ashutosh Mishra, Senior Marketing Executive from Cflux Agency. Ashutosh, great to have you with us. Thanks, thanks, Andre, for having me. Thank you. So, Ashutosh, what are, in your opinion, the best practices for developing a hybrid mobile app? Okay, so a hybrid app is basically a web application that is given a lightweight native container, allowing it to leverage the native platform software as well as hardware features. So features that a web application doesn't allow like camera utilities or touch responses or maybe push notifications. So a hybrid app also allows cross-platform functionality. Whereas a native app is specifically coded for the specific platform to leverage the features of that particular platform. This means a native app for an Android cannot be contained in the iOS platform. The app needs to be coded from the scratch for iOS as well. Great, so um, when should one make a hybrid app and when should they make a native app? So to answer that, uh, uh, certain parameters that uh, a hybrid app needs can be uh, cross-platform functionality or a lightweight app that uh, users uh, can have easy access. Then if you need a higher productivity of your developers or maybe if you are running low on your budget and need to save cost on the production as a hybrid app doesn't require to record for another platform from the scratch. So whereas uh, for a native app, uh, advantages could be a native app is more focused on the performance uh, of the app on an individual platform. Mm -hmm. Then uh, it has a great UI for flawless usage. Then it has a better offline usability and a native app can integrate sophisticated features of a particular platform. So to conclude, Knowing these things before jumping into deciding the right platform for your enterprise mobility needs would be very crucial. Ashutosh, I thank you so much for contributing to Design Rush Quick Sites.